Hello everybody, welcome back to another weird uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! redesign stream. I guess we're gonna try something extremely bad <laughs> today, another one of those awful cards. Uh, I've got plenty saved in Pinterest, you can also go and check them out, and I also got them here on my other screen, so we'll see, probably might do the Emperor of Wind, whatever, Dragon thing. But in the meantime, hello Chase, welcome. So, uh, Chase, is there anything in particular you would like to see? Because I got some um, requests from Reddit. They posted in the Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, Yu community. And uh, someone said... Let me grab it. I grabbed it before. But... Uh, they, By the way, they told me that this thing kind of reminds them of a, a, a monster from Zelda. That's a... Uh, Octo... Octo... What? Rock. <laughs> Octorok, yes. Uh, so, uh, kind of, I guess, a little bit. So, uh, Lord of Zemia is one of the requests I received. What do you think? Uh, that's a, I mean, that's a weird one. I don't think it's that bad, personally. No, it's not that bad. It's it's kind of... I mean, it's not good either. Like, <laughs> it's, uh, it's too confused. <laughs> So, if I go take my board, where is it? <clears throat> Epic fail you get. So, I've got, well, I've got a few stinkers here. Might be worth doing. <laughs> uh, Do you want to try Fiend's Hand? <laughs> Uh no, not the hand. No, I would need reference for the hand. Probably, and I'm not going to dry hands. No well, this prevent rat is really bad. It's like an armadillo sort of thing. It's, I mean, it's very flat. Uh, aqua dragon uh, bed cropping. Uh, the Lord of Zemi has this one uh, again. Bed cropping. This is what the hell is this? The melting red shadow. What? is going on there you can't really tell where the legs are uh it's weird <laughs> beat dragon jungle king also pretty bad cropping in my opinion uh stone ogre grotto is bad ancient lizard warrior it's bad this one has got a bad texture <laughs> armored rat well we already you know it's similar to this by the way Raven rat. Yeah, it's, it's actually the same design. Yeah, they did that a lot. It's uh, uh, sandstone, uh, javelin beetle. I think it's just bed cropping for this. Like bed, bed pose, bed cropping, bed rendering. Uh, 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 and Ryu also. I don't, I don't like it. Uh, probably not gonna do a dragon though, because I did a lot of dragons recently, so I might do something else. This is, uh, I forgot the name of, it's like an armadillo sort of thing. The one you mentioned nice the other armadillo. day. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's ugly. So, I don't know, uh, there's plenty to choose from. That ruby uh, dragon is fake, by the way. Which one? The ruby Oh, this dragon. one is fake? But I looked it up, I looked it up, I, I wanted to make sure of it. And I looked it up. I looked up no, the image the and it was... The actual card is Luster Dragon. That's that's a, a recolor of Luster Dragon. Okay, because I looked up, I looked up the card to make sure, because it looked like it could be. Uh, well, I'm gonna remove it. Then, I remove it. You can just add Luster Dragon. <laughs> no, I'm gonna remove it. Because gonna... I only want to put the actual cards here. I don't want to deceive people. Um. So. I could do the melting red shadow or maybe another one that's I could do one that's that could be good with better rendering and better cropping like it doesn't need as much modifications that maybe I can just paint over instead of redrawing the whole thing uh I'm trying to find something though because these are pretty bad uh I mean, this one, Stone Ogre Grotto, I guess it's you know, mostly about the rendering, it's too much. Like, the too reflective, probably. Uh, Armored Rat, I guess in this uh, geese, it's uh, it's better, but not that good, anyway. Uh, 
Hmm. Hmm. Which one should we do? Let me see the other ones I have on my screen because I have more. I have the ones you sent. The lady there, but I'm not gonna do hands. Uh, that that emperor of thousand winds, whatever. It's also a viable one. Emperor of the land and sea. That one, yes. Uh, it's a. Uh, you see how good I am at remembering names. Oh, oh well, thanks for following. Sav. Saving Tismo? Thank you for following. I appreciate it. Um, <clears throat> trying to figure out... Oh, hey, a guy. Hello, Mr. Guy. <laughs> Hello there. At least I know you're a guy and not a girl. Because <laughs> it's a guy. Welcome to the stream, everybody. <clears throat> okay, Saving Tismo is from Italy, apparently, like me. Well, like me for two days and then <laughs> not anymore. Um... <laughs> uh... <clears throat> Which one should I? Uh, I'm gonna do the roaring. Is this a real card? I think it is. Roaring ocean snake, yeah. This this one actually the sea is not too bad. It's just a little too jagged. Uh, it's not that bad. You can see like, that the modern ones are much better. In any case, you take a pendulum card is much better. Uh, if it's real, I don't know. This is no, it's not. <laughs> Ah, man, it's so hard to tell which ones are real and which ones are not. Uh, the Ancient Lizard is also pretty bad, but... I want to try to mm, do one without having to change everything, because I feel like most of these require everything. Uh, no, I'm leaving. I'm going to Japan uh, in two days. <laughs> I live in Japan. Sometimes. So I'm going back to my kids in a couple days so no and i'm not good at playing Yu-Gi-Oh anyway <laughs> uh i i play master duo sometimes when i feel like i want to get frustrated and angry <laughs> not really uh beautiful <laughs> my wife is japanese uh trust me it's not something you want to get into <laughs> It's really not something you want to get into. Unless you, you like pain. Maybe you like pain. I don't know. If you like pain, yeah. You if like you the Lord of Zemia, since someone requested it, we can... That's the Lord of Zemia. I don't know exactly what this is, though. What the hell is this? What the hell is it? Is it a dragon? Like, where are the, the hands coming out of? You love Japan? Have you ever lived in Japan? Because I lived in Japan long enough to get sick of it. Literally. I've never been so sick as when I am in Japan. So now I've not been sick for four months because I've been here, and uh, I'm gonna I'm getting ready to uh, visiting the hospital more than I would like. <laughs> Readings to the police operator. <laughs> I think it's re uh, referring to you, Chase. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> I don't know. Do I sound dumb? Uh, it might be a little lower than me, yeah, but I don't know how to, to bump it up more than this, because it's already 200 on on Discord, so... If I if I bump it up more than this, then every single sound my computer makes is going to be extremely loud. I have the exact same microphone as you, so... See, I don't know. I don't know exactly what happened. My settings did not change, so... I don't know. Uh, I don't think you sound that low, at, le at least for me, like uh, when I, when I rewatch the... Preview streams. What do I do in my life? This. <laughs> well, not Yu-Gi-Oh cards, though. I, uh, I am. Uh, well, I'm a web developer and a concept artist slash illustrator for games. Yes, I'm an artist. Yes. Uh, well, you could say that. I'm not really an artist. I guess not much artist art artsy, but uh, kind of. Uh, so, <laughs> what do I want to do with this thing? We're accepting bets on what this thing actually is. Uh, it's some sort of dragon. Like, where's this piece coming from? Like, okay, let's analyze this first. Am I European or American? <laughs> I'm Italian, actually. <laughs> it's not obvious by the way he's speaking. Huh? No, it's not obvious, really? I don't know. Well, I guess you can tell no, if you're American. No, I said yeah. it's obvious by the way you're speaking. Oh, yeah. American. Yeah, but for, like you, you can tell, but here, they can't. <laughs> they actually can't. 
So, uh, anyway. So Lord this of Xenia appeared in the anime briefly. It seems to recognize the Kami. Body. Yes. Oh, it says Kami, yes. Because it says Kami here. I cannot read a kanji, but this is Kami. Uh, Xenia no Kami. So... Yeah, it's like God of Xenia. Yes, I am Italian. <laughs> I never use it, though. Except when I'm home here. <laughs> Because I, I use English most of I use English with my kids and with everyone else. The only people I, I speak uh, Italian with are locals when I go to the gym, and my mom and uh, my my only friend here. <laughs> uh, but I tend not to use it on stream because it's not like otherwise people do not understand on average. So anyway, yeah, this is some sort of it said it said basically uh, Xenia God. Yeah. So, um... And Zamia is Greek. What does it mean? It means it, it means something like loss or hurt. So the god of hurt. The god of loss. Okay, see, I don't think they understand that. It's a pretty local, uh... Pretty local no, celebrity. No, Japanese just name things. They don't understand the meanings behind them. Uh, no, 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 I was, sorry. I was uh, answering to... To, uh, Sabint. Tismo. Seven, I guess seven is good. It's just short enough. Um, what do I want to do with this? Because uh, so there is a kind of tendril coming out of here. Uh, I'm having a very hard time understanding what's going on. So this is a hand. Well, I just mentioned that this appears in the anime briefly, and they gave it kind of a draconic body. In their Let me see. Ah, so. oh, you There you go. Uh, draconic body. Do you like Yu-Gi-Oh? Seven. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna look it up. It's uh, okay. <laughs> I can, I can I can see the the side of it. Yeah, it, it, I figured it would be some sort of dragon, but I don't think it matches the card because this like. What the hell is this? Like, there's an eye here. That's an eye. Not as much as Japanese girls. Like, because they have a low IQ. Beautiful black hair. Eh. I don't want to start insulting Japan again. I will do it plenty, I guess, in a few days. We're not... You know what the problem with Japanese... You know that the problem with Japanese women is? They might even be beautiful, but they have no brain <laughs> inside that head, so... Uh, it's not really easy to deal with them. Um, so one of the hands is here. I don't know, like, what is what the hell is that part? So this is the neck, clearly. Uh, Jesus, why did I choose this? Uh, you know, the body oh. looks very flat, like the way the tendril and eye are positioned. I'm wondering if, like. You can make it almost oval shaped in that way. Well, uh, clearly the body needs to do something like this because there is a neck here, so it's gonna go into something. Uh, almost like a like a floating mirror with arms and a head. The point is, this thing has like this thing makes no sense. Like, what is this? It's a, is it a leg? What is it? Thing on the uh, bottom right. Yeah. yeah, I guess it's a leg. But what is this thing? Or is that supposed, is that supposed to be the arm connecting to the hand? Why is it going? Why is it going like away towards the bottom thing? It should be the opposite. Well, it, it's it's angling up, and then the hand is. No, is no, no, no. It should it should do camera. something like it should do something like this. See, if it was coming towards us, because the the circles should be coming towards us, not going away. But these are going away, so we yeah. have it's like we have something that's coming here and doing this. I'm saying that's probably what they meant. It's oh, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I guess. Uh, okay, let's. Uh... <laughs> what do I start? <laughs> Look at the nose! Like what the hell? This is something like an AI could have made. <laughs> it's like one of those images. Uh, the yeah, the Rorschach. blots. Where do I see in it? Uh, Let's see. Oh, if I squint really here's, hard. 
here's your Rorschach test. What do you think this is? Uh, <laughs> we're, we're accepting bets uh, on what this is. <laughs> Uh, clearly this is the mouth, but like, why is, is there something that's coming out of, like, this way? But this is going backwards, it's not coming towards us. But this is like Selfie's hair, or kind of. <laughs> it's some sort of hood. Yeah, and there is, uh, uh, the nose here, okay, there's a hole. Hey, yo, Simon, how's it going? Uh, okay, then there are two, like, four spikes here. Two horns, two horns. To horns, uh, in a oh fins. Look at this membranes. My beloved, love it. Membranes. Uh, I mean, I the, like some of the design ideas and like the color scheme and whatnot. But the overall where is the hand coming out of? Like, what is? Is it some sort of turtle? It could be. Yeah. Uh, kind of look, has that shell quality, like the curvature. Yeah, so if I were it's like a turtle demon dragon, I mean, okay, I I'm not against it. Yeah, there's a guy in the chat. Yes, a guy, <laughs> literally, a guy. Uh, oh, this is gonna be rough. I don't know if I want to keep this uh, piece of worm. Thing. Or I wonder if this other no, this is probably not related. What is this other thing? Like this hand is floating. It's like Rabio's head with a cobra like design. Uh you know what I gotta I'm assuming he okay. means Rabio, Lord of Phantasms. I'm so bad with names, I've probably seen this a couple times, or a thousand times. Oh, oh, okay, I know this card, yeah. I know the card. Uh, yeah, I can see that. I'm never gonna, you know what, I think one of the reasons why I'm never gonna be good at Yu-Gi-Oh! is because I cannot remember our names and what they do. I <laughs> just remember the image. <laughs> uh... Uh, okay, I appreciate the fact that it, the hand is coming towards us. That's not too bad. But, uh... The other, the other hand is what's throwing me off, though. Like, where is it coming from? I don't know why they put it in there. Like, what's the point? Like, is it, like, is it extruding from the shell in the back? Okay, let me try. Like, he can retract his claws or whatever? First, I would probably turn this. Okay, let's try, let's try something. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna try to. First, I will edit it like this, and then we'll see if I can paint over. The, if I at a student present something like this, I, I would be like, "Please do it again." Like I have no idea how to fix it. As it is, like unless I redo it from scratch. This well, is you bad. Said that about, like Ma Barrel. So let's see what you can do with this. <laughs> yeah, but that was. It was a little simpler. <laughs> okay, let me try to get rid of this. This is just, there is too much going on here. Okay, that's the thing. There's too much going on. Uh, okay, I need somewhere. This. Probably doing this what here. What exactly is the background image supposed to be? Water? Caustics? Somewhat? Smoke? Huh? Like a ring? Yeah, like a smoke filter or a noise tank? I don't know. Is... Chat, what do you think this is in the background? Some psychedelic uh, kind of thing? It reminds me of smoke rings. Yeah, it looks kind of like smoke, though half of it is... Sort of caustics. Or caustics. Caustics. It's a trap! <laughs> yes. It, it sounds like it is a trap. It probably is. Welcome, Matthews. <clears throat> you can play It's a Trap when there's a trap card. 
I should probably do some trap cards too, not just monster cards. I think I've only done monster cards so far. Apart from trap hole, obviously. Apart from trap hole. Um, well, trap hole was just... Uh, trap hole has been bothering me ever since I first watched Yu-Gi-Oh! So... I knew that. What's the name What's of this card? Of this card? Uh, Lord of Zemia or God of Zemia? Oh. Or Zemia. technically Zemia. In Japanese. Zemia no ka. Zemia. No, this is Zemia. Like Zeri. Uh which mean which means jelly. So it could be Definitely. it could be Jamia. J Jamia. Jamia? Yeah, because jelly is Zeri with Z. This is jelly in Japanese. <laughs> You know, you know what, you know what I hate about this? That they make my kids watch Tom and Jerry at the daycare on Saturdays. And because of how it's freaking pronounced in Japanese, it's, they pronounce it like tomato jelly, which sounds like tomato jelly. It sounds like tomato jelly. <laughs> and so I was like, the first time I was like, do you want a tomato jelly? Are you kidding me? Then I figured out it was Tom and Jerry, but damn. Did they watch that in the Squallow room? In the Squallow, yes. Um, I think it was actually- no. It was the Panda room. Pander? Pander. No, no, that's Panda. It's Panda. Do we have any- uh, Pander. Basically Pander. Are any, are any of the Australians in the chat? <laughs> Pander. <Talk about> panders. <laughs> Okay, let's uh, let's get rid of some junk here. I think it's starting to be a little more clear now. Like if I draw from side to side, basically, it's a little more clear. Sounds good. What sounds good? Tomato jelly. Uh, oh man, I'm gonna have such a hard time reteaching English to them. God damn. Uh, well, the wings are gonna obviously gonna need to change because this is preposterous. <laughs> wings yeah, cannot. Well, even changing like the that. head is an improvement. This cannot be. Obviously. Wing is gonna be red altogether. Do not confuse with the. This has a 3D model in Duelist of the Roses, by the way, if you want to look at that. Let me see. I can uh, post it in the chat. Oh yeah, please. It's different than the one in the anime. So. Oh, so one of the hands is supposed to be like that. Well, ah, now I get it. This is clear. It's not a bad design, actually. It's actually pretty cool. If they clarified it... Okay, I'm gonna have to clarify it then. So it's got one hand that's sticking out of the... Whatever body it has. Like th this thing. So that's that's correct. But... But... Uh, <laughs> it's supposed to be grotesque looking, I would imagine. Show us. Oh, you don't see the link? Oh. Sorry about that. This is the... Well, he's on YouTube. You might not be able to click it. This is pretty cool. It's not a bad design. I like it. Honestly, I like it. It's pretty neat. I would like it a lot in a, a game. So. so let's see how I can inform <clears throat> this design. <clears throat> I mean, this could Hey, Free for Fire, welcome. Oh, yo, Ben, how are you doing? <coughs> Damn it. Could even be. I mean, I could, I could probably leave it. Once. Let's, let's leave it like this for now. Uh, 
uh, but the hand will need to rotate from. Man, if I could, you know, go through the, the confines of the card, the frame. If I could do that like I do with my monsters, or like they do in any other game, basically. Because <clears throat> this is a god, come on. It's a god. Also, I think they took some liberties here in the game, so someone had to figure it out, obviously. So they lower, they made the neck longer, and the, the wings are starting a little higher. Which is not good for this card, probably, but this one needs to start a little more toward that one. It's doing fine, just tired. I'm sorry to hear that. Sorry to hear you're fine. <laughs> you're tired. I think this, what, this guy requires a full redesign to better show it. He has a lot of things emerging from its body. It might. To be fair, a lot of old Yu-Gi-Oh cards are just badly drawn. I mean, even... Blue eyes kind of look weird. It kind of... They kind of look weird. <clears throat> this might need a full redesign though, because... Man, you can't really tell what's going on. Like, if I see that, I think... Man, that's a cool card. Uh, well, a cool, cool monster. But this is... Preposterous. <laughs> uh, the cropping might not be helping. So... It kind of works better as a 3D model, to be honest. Yeah, I can work as a as a picture as well. Not this picture, though. Yeah, but you're you're gonna have to zoom out and make some of the details a little more apparent with it. Oh yeah. So what if I? It's too zoomed in, and that kind of obscures like what it's supposed to be. Yes. So what if I... No. Yes. Well, let's, let's actually expand it then. I'm gonna try to do this. In any case, I will not be able to finish it before I go to Japan. Because uh, tomorrow we're gonna play Final Fantasy VII. So... It's Jermaine. And finish this. But I want to finish it at some point, so maybe I will just... Redo it. Uh, I think the Red Eye Black Dragon had better design. Oh, uh, yes. It's also a lot simpler than this. <laughs> it's way simpler. This is just, there's just too much going on. That's the problem. Like, here, get, get rid of all this stuff. If you want to, designs need not be this complicated. <laughs> Uh, because you can't understand what's going on. So... You can't really understand. I think they got rid of this. No, they actually kept these as, um... As, like, the uh, scales. Best way to describe most Yu-Gi-Oh cards is just clusterfuck. <laughs> yeah, that's part of the charm, though. <laughs> Or to quote my good friend um, Jake, shit fuck. <laughs> I mean, I like, I like wany, <laughs> like zany, wacky designs, as opposed to just doing the same. Oh yeah, I I do like uh, weird designs too, but probably this is probably. Too but you need to clarify it more. Yeah, I'm gonna have to redo that. No, there is no way I can fix this. Like, like it is. It's just too bad. <laughs> I mean, it was better than the blue dragon. Oh, oh, you mean uh, in, in general? Uh, you prefer red eyes over blue eyes? I don't know. I like blue eyes. Blue eyes. Uh, red eyes feels like a very um, spiky. A little too spiky sometimes. I don't know. In general, I feel like all Blue the dragons there are a little too robotic. Blue Eyes is a little more sleek looking. They're yeah. going for different things with the two of them. Uh, yes. I'm going to start recording even though I don't know if I'm take the Japan. Because I don't even know if I can use Clip Studio, probably not. Uh, 
Lucifer can be fun, but there is fun and there is <laughs> what even is this? Yeah, like trap hole. Sorry, I'm sorry to those uh, of you out there who are trap hole lovers. I'm not. <laughs> oh, I don't think there's many, but I don't know. I actually got a message, uh, one of the comments saying, "Oh, I prefer the original." Um, I don't like. I don't care if you don't like what I do. It's fine, but I think the original is just a piece of trash. <laughs> Pretty much anything is better than the original, so... Not trying to defend what I do, it's just that it really sucks. Yeah, it looks skinnier and sharper, yes. Why didn't I eat cookies a while ago? I'm hungry now. Uh, so, okay. I'm gonna use... I'm gonna use a 3D model as a reference. And I'm gonna, uh, use pose. The pose is kind of like blue eyes, but... So this is not a dragon. It's some sort of bat with... With the, uh, like... The sort of thing going on here. Man, they must like the, uh... You know, this sort of thing a lot. Because they use it on Akihiran too. Fun fact. Blue eyes' head resembles a shark. Or resembles something else. Resembles uh, the, uh, the Xenomorph too. <laughs> Because like, actually, was, I was a huge say, yeah. The head shape does remind me of the xenomorph. Yes, yeah, so it's phallic, <laughs> basically. Uh, also, it's white, so it's kind of weird and stressful. Which is appropriate for both HR Giger and Japan. Yes. The original looked like the victim was not human. Uh. Yes. Anyway. Man, jokes apart, I, I think the, the the 3D model here is great. With those extra spikes on the tail, it's a really good model. Props to whoever designed it. Because they had to do a I, lot of work. I, yeah, I like the, the idea of the body too more than just making it like a normal dragon body. Like having oh, it's it great. It's, it's, it's great, yes. Yeah. Let's see, obviously we got like this. Just, just a little bit. So we can keep the hand. Actually, I can. I can where is it? I can. I mean, I'm gonna use it. Why not? In any case. It's, oh man, this looks like an evil duck. An evil duck. <laughs> Look at or a penguin. <laughs> uh, okay, something like. This might work. Let's Happy see. feet, more like angry feet. Look at me. <laughs> Happy feet. Uh, you know, I, there is a funny story about Happy Feet. So, obviously, I was familiar with the movie. Well, whatever that is. I didn't watch it, but, it, you know, I heard about it. I've seen things about it. Uh, and so, at some point, I. Uh, work on a website that sold shoes and the name was we have feet <laughs> and so every every single time i could not remember the name and i would type in uh happy feet <laughs> instead <laughs> which obviously didn't take me to the correct website unsurprisingly uh <laughs> Yeah, Happy Feet is a better name than We Have Feet. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Uh, so I gotta figure out. It's it's. I like the fact that it's got um a different um that it's not symmetrical basically. But I think yeah. there's too much going on there. Like, why why does it have the twirly thing coming out of the wing in a, in an eye? An eye, sir. Is going for something grotesque. I don't know if it's if maybe the look like an abomination. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I did an abomination, so <laughs> shouldn't the name be? We have shoes. I don't know. Don't ask me. Don't ask me. Or maybe it's we all have feet, therefore you need shoes, and we have it here. 
Hey, we have feet for your shoes. <laughs> feet for your shoes. <laughs> feet for your shoes. <laughs> oh, the planet's coming back. We, we, sell, we sell feet for your shoes here. Don't ask where we got the feet. <laughs> we, picture, we have pictures of feet. I think I read somewhere that some... Egg? Is that an egg? Penguins. <laughs> oh, it's a penguin. <laughs> oh yeah, I can see. I can see the black penguin. So, um, no, I don't think I want to use this sort of. What do you have? Ah, I mean, this. I could t if I could see. I want to see where it comes. Um, so it comes from here. Given, like, let's be honest. It's a cool interpretation, but the original idea was that this was another hand. Clearly, clearly. So I like the, the redesign better, but this was supposed to be a hand. So they just <laughs> drew it really bad. Uh, in my opinion. I guess. I kind of like the idea of the hand being embedded into the body more, though. Oh, yeah. Something like this, and maybe maybe the eye is where the hand is. Instead of being underneath, like the eye is... Like, if the thumb is here, the eye is in between. Like that well, uh, you know, Naruto guy. I might be wrong, but like when you look at the 3D model, it looks like it only has like the one eye. Like, the other eye is missing. And so I'm yeah. wondering if, like, the other eye got embedded oh. into the body or something. Oh, wait a second. Yeah, I think even in this, I don't think it's got the eye on the other side. It might be implied, but they don't show it. In the 3D model, it looks like they just have the one eye, from what I can tell. Unless it's not visible because of the eye and the coverage. It could be worse, like, we have the necessary anatomical requirements to <laughs> for wearing shoes. Yes. I like that idea, though. Like, some of its body parts are getting lost in its overall body. Like, it should have an eye up there, but the eye is embedded, like, under its arm. <laughs> it's weird. It is weird. It is weird. Uh, okay. So, this is getting closer. Why do you have something over here? It's like when this guy was born, he had like tons of genetic deformities, and that's why he's filled with hatred. <laughs> Could be. Mm. It's. Please, sir, give me something. <laughs> Okay, what if it's uh, in the in the spirit of what I've been doing recently? It's actually trying to uh, grab towards the camera a little more. Oh, this color! Trying to grab him. Oh God, Nemo! This is this is reminds me of something. <laughs> what? The uh, the El Noil from FF8. Ah. Yes, it does. Uh, because of the of the wings and those things here, yes. It does a little bit. <clears throat> it does. I don't think I want to go with something like this, though. Ooh, ooh. Oh, shoop. Shoop. Um, I don't think... Let me see the other... Um... God's card. Oh. The other gods. The other god cards. Um. It's such a strange design. I like it. Um. Not the original artwork, though. 
Egyptian got slime? Is this a real thing? Yes. Jeez, how do you remember all those cards by name, by the way? Oh, well, I own that card. Still not remember it. <laughs> the original name is Godo Suraimu. God of Shrime. Speaking of, yesterday I did go and follow the, the link Matt, um, I think Daniel posted on Discord uh, of, of Filthy Frank. I mean, I sure yes. hope my kids don't turn up like that. <laughs> I actually told my wife today, like, unless you want our kids to turn up like that, stop making them stupid. <laughs> if you like know, you're he, growing he, up in Japan, it becomes like that. His pickup lines are great if you watch his videos. <laughs> Yeah, I just, I don't want my kids to be like that, sorry. I don't care if he makes a lot of money. I don't want my, my kids to be buffoons. Uh, so no offense to him, we're all offense, whatever. Huh? It may be unavoidable since you're their father. <laughs> I'm not like that. Research. Chaos Core. I remember it was an amalgamation of design as well. Uh, no, he's just filthy. <laughs> Come on. Chaos Core. Oh. Oh, this looks pretty cool. I like this design. Let me show it. Uh, it's blurry though. I don't know why there are some other weird. <laughs> What's, that? What's this? <laughs> like I don't care what the other uh, things are. There is a guy with flaming shoes. <laughs> but, <laughs> what the? <laughs> what the? <laughs> what? <laughs> I guess uh, a guy was referring to. This. Uh, you want them to baking pew cake when they grow up? No. Also being slightly emetophobic, definitely not. Definitely not. I'm glad he dropped YouTube and went into music. He's good at music. YouTubers from his generation side of YouTube didn't turn out great. Like cheese. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help it. <laughs> She's deserved it. No, because it's great. Yeah. <laughs> but still, he should be here. <laughs> I don't know why he's not. I asked him if he's dead. It didn't reply. So <laughs> I guess. <laughs> well, he was posting yesterday. He yeah. just didn't respond. Yeah, when I think about Chaos Core, I imagine fl <laughs> a flimmy shopping cart. <laughs> I mean, it is pretty chaotic. Yeah. So anyway, am I will, will I be able to find some kind of design out of this thing or not? Given that this thing is already better than the original, uh, it's just not very comprehensible. Uh, let me let me do something different for this one. I'm gonna go over this like it's not terrible. Can you work with? I mean, if you're gonna like like the tentacle thing, right? Why would you just have the one tentacle? Why would you not just include multiple tentacles if you're going to include that as a detail? Right. So, so I, 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 I would either get rid of the tentacle or add more if you want to go for that sort of grotesque effect. Right. So let's say I. Uh... Make this a little wider. H3, H3 was not good too. E Ethan Klein, yeah. I, I do not like him. Ethan? You know H3, H3. No, what is that? He's a YouTube channel. I thought it was HQ, HQ. Usually. They, they, they do like reaction videos and sketch comedy and stuff like okay. that. Okay. An internet drama. I see. 
Okay, what about this? I, keep, I can't think of anything more pathetic than, like, having drama with other people on the internet. Real. <laughs> Real. It is pretty pathetic. Um, it's okay, let's consider, like, there isn't, um, a 3D model. What if it's just... I mean, I could I could consider it a little bit. I do like these these things that are like a cape, but I I I do see a sort of turtle quality in this. Honest. But what if it's some kind of turtle? Vape nation. I would I would still keep like the like the elongated body like the almost insect body kind of concept with like the thorax and the abdomen. I think that's a neat idea. It is. It probably. What if I shorten the neck? And I. Yeah. Oh, no. Let's something. Erase this. I want to keep the original. Um, I don't think the neck should be that long. It becomes too draconic if I do. Clearly the hand could come towards us. This, but this is what I like about Japanese designs. Like a demon insect turtle <laughs> abomination. Yes, if this was drawn well, it would be a cool card, honestly. Well, let's see, this might take me, I don't think it's going to look good today. It might take me a few attempts. But if I if I tackle this, I'm pretty sure I can turn it into something cool. Anyway, yes, Simon, I agree. I agree, just... So, uh, I do like that almost insect-like feel, like you said. Oh, by the way, everybody, I'm going to have to copy and paste this because you can't see it on YouTube. We have a Discord. If you if you want to join and talk about stuff, feel free I'll to do it. The link still uh, works. Uh, this one should work. Yeah, it's a new one. Uh, I was thinking maybe we could we could have some like a master duel or or even a Magic the Gathering session with the chat or with the Discord members. Sometimes I I, I play uh, Magic anyway, so I think master Alex duel. I don't know because it depends on the deck. If you use meta decks, then no. <laughs> I think Alessandro actually like streams Magic the Gathering. Mystery. Sometimes yes. I think I actually vanquished him once. I, uh, <laughs> I uh, S faulted him. Uh, this once though in the Italian stream. But he's pretty good. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This is already a little clearer anyway, but I don't know if I, if I dig it. If I dig it. I don't know if I dig it. I don't know if I dig it this one. Uh, uh, um. Boom, 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 boom. Um, hmm. Oh, these could be even bigger. Oh, wait. Oh. Show that the arm is coming out of here. And maybe... Okay, I think I get it. No, I don't. Oh, it's still wrong. <laughs> no, because I can, I can see the arm in the... What the hell is that thing on the... 
There is something on the arm, on the elbow, on the 3D model, I have no idea what. Uh, so the arm could be doing this, right? Could be, maybe if I play here. Yeah, I noticed that too, there's like a white thing hanging off of the yes. elbow. Yes. Uh, let's Cool if it was like an exposed bone or something. Uh, it could be holding something. Uh, like turtle sort of. Okay, this is not too bad. But I need something to kind of bring back the viewer into the scene. Because it's the fact that there is nothing on the other side is really not conducive to it. Uh, good layout. Um, what if I swap? Swap the. Oh, are you leaving, Simone? All right. Have a good night. Yep. See you later, Simone. See you tomorrow, hopefully, then, yeah, either tomorrow or tomorrow, because then it's not going to be any other chance for a while. Hopefully, we'll see you tomorrow. Mm. Hmm. So, what if I... Okay, this might be pretty okay. This it's going towards yeah no I'm too far it's going inside something like this but monster is going that direction <laughs> it's got a pipe hey look it's Popeye. Can I do it? Can you draw a cell phone in his hand? A cell phone? <laughs> because it looks like it's... Like, like, look at this funny meme I saw. <laughs> no, it's like taking a selfie or something. I still prefer the slight modification I made before, even if it's not that clear. Uh. Um, what if it's got like pockets? Okay, it's got pockets. And then, just like the hand here. Although the hand, the bikes, whatever. And, but I, I need to show, I want to show that there's something else, because this is flat. This is, yeah, the, the hand is, or the arm is coming towards us, but it's mostly, mostly, it's pretty flat. It's gonna be a kaiju from a kaiju movie. <laughs> no kidding. Godzilla versus Lord of Xenia. <laughs> uh, bad, but I'm sure. Did you know in like the late seventies they had like a film idea for Godzilla versus the Devil? Want to see that? <laughs> that sounds fun. Well, they later made a comic book about uh, Godzilla and Hell. Oh, Godzilla was not a good boy. Not a good kid. He ended up in Hell. Well, he fights through Hell, and then 
all of the angels come to like congratulate them, and then he kills all of the angels too. So he just kills everybody. <laughs> that sounds like not trash at all. Sounds like a very level level headed movie. Well, it's not a movie; it's a comic book. Oh right. Uh, yes, it would be. It would be a level headed movie though. It's a level headed story anyway. Like, look at this image. This is like one of the covers. <laughs> I mean, the art is good. <laughs> It's pretty cool. It's, it's like very... Um, it reminds me of those classic illustrations of the Lost World. A lot. Okay, what <laughs> and, and one of them, like the angels have moth rings. Pretty cool. <laughs> okay, what if this thing is coming towards us then? Like, what if this is really perspectivized? Perspectivize. It's really for a short I'm Trying to show it though, because this isn't show enough. Right? Might have to shrink it. Come on. I think Godzilla's in the game. There's an archetype literally called Kaiju. Yeah, he, technically Dogaron, the Mad Flame Kaiju, is probably supposed to be Godzilla. But Gamma Seal is absolutely Gamera. Gamera. We should have. We should really have a. I don't know when at this point because when I'm in Japan, I can't stream when it's a decent time anywhere else. So my evening is going to be your morning. Uh, we should have some kind of watch party at some point though. Why does Japan have a shitty time zone? Oh Just yeah. Just the two of us. To me. I don't want to huh? watch anything. What do you say? Just you and me though. <laughs> Why? I don't want a bunch of randos joining the voice call <laughs> and talking over the movie. But only trusted people. Exactly. Which is me and you. <laughs> <laughs> Why I said she shouldn't join. Uh, or cheese. I, if cheese joined, he would be like, oh, I, I, let's watch the notebook. <laughs> <laughs> I watched a parody where Cyber and Dragon was called Mecha King Ghidorah. <laughs> oh, makes sense though. Makes sense. Okay, how about this? Let's make this a little more sensed. Maybe, maybe the hand is retracting inside this shell thing. I don't know. I'm not. I'm okay, not convinced. No. Yeah. Oh, you gotta go. I'm gonna have to go. Yep. All right. Uh, good luck with your movie watching, and uh, talk to you tomorrow. Yep. I will see. Tomorrow, I guess, if you're streaming FF7. Yes. All right. See ya. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. I will keep uh, streaming solo. Eh, I don't know if I want to go with this. It's not bad. It's not bad. Not bad. But it's missing something. It's missing something. Shun thing is messing. Uh, clearly, this could be that. I want the perspective to be a little more exaggerated. I, I think this can fly, but. Ha! Huh, no pun intended. Uh, this can work, but it needs. Oops. It needs... Oh, that's how I end up. I was wondering, like, why do I end up with a, like, a... a scarred skin on my thumb? It's because I it's, it keeps bumping against the, the tablet when I use it. I was wondering the other day, I'm like, ooh, what's this? Well, now I know.
Okay, this might be a little bit too, too close and too zoomed in, but it might work. This turns around, goes here. No. I have point is I don't have any anchor to show that it's it's coming towards us. If not, like I can make the um, it bigger. Good Lord, Clip Studio is slow. Perspective, I can definitely make the bigger, but and it would become too big, or the hand needs to be huge at that point. The hand needs to be gigantic. Let's do this. <laughs> That obvious that it's uh that's because we have the hand already. Mm. I don't like this, but the head feels small. Damn. I don't know for shortening. Also, I completely lost the fact that it's got the moment. Okay, something like that. Maybe this work. I'm gonna start rendering it. Probably work in large something. It might work. Let me try to clear. Oh, by zoom in, reducing the brush size. the other screen so that I can ease on it. Can I copy it? I still have a soft spot for this for some. It's got a soft spot for this. Oops. Um Hmm, it does look like the eye might be closed. There, so, hmm. Uh, would, you, would anyone uh, be up, like, from in the Discord, obviously, uh, and during some streams, would you like, would you, would you like it? <laughs> if we played uh, Master Duel, Master Duel sometimes, with no meta decks, like, any deck that it's like branded despot, whatever. Like no, no dragon maids, nothing like that. Uh, but uh, we could play sometimes, I guess. Or I could just stream it, like playing solo, basically. Uh, would you guys be interested? I think it's supposed to be some sort of bat because it's got the bat nose basically it's just a hole but i feel like this was supposed to be a bat nose dun -dun 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 -dun. would be cool cool i'm gonna think about it 
So I don't know if you'll be able to join Matthews because it's going to be in the morning your time. Unless I stream in the evening your time. Sometimes. Sometimes I might do it. If I have no work. But it's more than likely that I will stream when it's evening in Japan. Uh, so that's uh, morning over there. Did you? Were you able to join when I was in Japan? I forgot. It's been it's been long, and my memory fails me. I try to forget everything about Japan; otherwise, I can't go back. <laughs> I remember how bad it is. I can't make myself go back. So, forgive me, my bad memory. Or maybe sometimes we could just, you know, organize uh, on Discord, even if I don't stream. I have a free day. <laughs> I get uh, some free time. <laughs> Not be complicated with the kids, but... but... I actually like the fact that this... Oh, I completely forgot the... You know, this could be since it's a god. Let's let's give it this sort of Egyptian brown thing, whatever it's called. Urban. Quite sure that the PM time in Japan is AM here, and vice versa. Uh, yes, because it's morning in the US, so it's gonna be more or less. I think you're in the same time zone as Chase. What time is it there now? Oh, there you go. It's the Emperor of Cheese. Without Godzilla. I must have run out of points. Cheese is not here anymore. You missed him. How is you doing, sir? How ELZ you doing? I'm going to redesign this thing. This thing. I think it's actually looking pretty good. Right now it's, it's 5 p.m. Then you might be an hour ahead of Chase. So if it's 5 p.m. now. No, you should be able to watch it if it's the if you are home. Because it's I would stream. Uh I mean it would be still morning for you, but not that early morning. Because I would stream like um, seven hours before now. So it would be 10 a.m. Kind of like 10, 9, 10 a.m. at your place. Oh, I can do Godzilla about 50 more times. <laughs> okay. Yes. Uh, no, I'm not setting up my, my schedule uh, yet for Japan. Because I don't know what's going to be. What it's going to be. What the? No, don't do this. Lasso. What's he, what's he doing? I don't know exactly when I'll stream yet, but it's not, you probably won't be able to join Cheese. It's gonna, it's likely gonna be early morning for you, unfortunately. I, I can, sometimes I might be able to stream when it's morning in Japan. If I, like I was saying, if I have some extra time from work, but uh, since I have to try to maximize what I am able to do, um, with all the projects that I have going on and a lot of I've got a lot of illustration work to do when I'm gonna settle down a lot of commission work uh, so I don't know if I can do it because I'm gonna have other I'm gonna have other things to do things to do so we'll see certainly I will stream I just don't know how often I will stream because in the even in any case the 
kids will need some realignment. I'm going to have to read them stories and stuff like that. So if they don't sleep, I can't stream. So, let's see. No, I cannot stream commissions. It's NDA. It's not even commissions. It's a, it's a contract. I have a few contracts uh, to work on. Three. And they have NDAs, so I cannot show what I'm doing. I cannot even talk about it. <laughs> so, because some of them, well, I can't say it. <laughs> but let's say it like some were Steam games, so uh, they are on Steam already. Uh, like the the companies are on Steam, and so the. I just can't do whatever I want <laughs> for these. Well, some people do it, yeah, if they're making a commission out of oh, whatever. Oh, no, oops. Like if it's a. Uh, if it's. Um, I know. Uh, a Reddit commission, maybe. Like, I don't think people can stream NDA stuff. <laughs> Otherwise, it wouldn't be NDA. It's like it's like you're working on a game that's very popular. You can't show stuff you're working on because you're gonna spoil it for everybody. When I was at SF Inter San Francisco International, there were tons of Air Japan planes. At least I know where to hitch a flight and visit Nemo, yeah, and get sick. <laughs> sure. I would feel really bad if you got sick because of me. And I cannot promise you would be able to sleep because my kids yell a lot. So. And I know we would have a fight. <laughs> At least one. Because I'm pretty nervous when I'm there. Yeah, I don't know what type of client you're working with. Yeah, they're companies, so... I had to sign the NDA if I wanted to work for them. With them. I'm not hired, but it's a contract. It's contract work, so... It's still non -disclo disclosable unfortunately I don't know if I'm going to add the um, whatever that's called little worm I'm kind of happy with how it's turning out. I need to make it look like a Yu-Gi-Oh card though, it's pretty, pretty fun. Fight? Oh yeah, we haven't had a big fight yet. <laughs> All the birds might have one big fight at one point. Yeah, but if I beat you up, I go, I go to jail uh, in Japan. <laughs> Come here, I can beat you up without me getting to jail, going to jail, I guess. But if a Japanese guy beats you up, he's not going to jail. You are. <laughs> That's how it works. Over there. I know what you're going to answer to this. Oh, I'm going to be the one beating you up, bro. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably not going to press charges. Fair fight. Or I can have my son beat you up because he's getting... He's doing kendo right now, so... <laughs> Actually, you know, fun fact, I might do kendo as well because if I have to take him there, I can probably take lessons too. That's what I've been told. I don't know if it's actually true because the information I'm usually told are not accurate. 
But if so, I might do kendo as well. I would rather do jujitsu, but the place where I wanted to go is too far. I'm going to post something later on Discord. The Japanese justice system is horrid. Oh, really? Really? Oh, Kendo, nice. I want. I would like to pick up martial arts again one day. Yeah, me too. If I had time. I wanted to do it here, but they didn't have anything, unfortunately, at the gym. I'm going. They have a, like a crappy um, self defense course or kickboxing, but it's not. It's not real. Like it's like it's not the actual thing. It's a generic program you find at gyms that's not really, doesn't really have good instructors or anything. So, okay, uh, I think this looks pretty decent. It's not bad, it's a little weighted on the left side, maybe, let's see if I can fix it. Just coming out of here, I guess. Just coming out of there. I turned this into an actual hand because I I want it to be some sort of hand. I don't I mean I could do this. It could be like this. All of these could be in the same side, but I kind of like the idea of a hand that's... A hand that's... Um, it's got a, an eye in the middle. Some sort of hand in the middle, actually. This might need to move. Uh, what's it got? What does he have here? Huh. Okay. Okay. I think it's looking pretty balanced. What do you think composition wise, Cheese? I feel I feel pretty good composition wise. I have to figure out that hand. Not looking too bad though. Eh. I mean, if I turn it, you can see what I mean. I guess you can see what I mean. It's very one-sided. That's the problem. It's it's a bit one-sided. You see, turn. That's why you always have to turn the drawings. I don't know what I can put here though. Like unless I. And because it's it's really not symmetrical as a beast. Like whatever I do, if I even if I sh switch the arm again, it's gonna look not balanced on the other side. See, if I do this, it's even it's even worse. But honestly, because that's the center of action, the attention will be on one side. Yes. Maybe I can... Okay, there you go. Maybe I can fill it up a little bit like that. And tilt it. Right now it's... Can you hear... Background noise from my stream Like a TV Make that hand eye a little bigger I could but I wanted it to feel kind of far away Basically I'm gonna have to tell my mom to lower the TV hold on it's really too loud
No, well, I was really loud here with the serving, so... <laughs> Uh, gross Italian music. <laughs> Not a fan. Or hide the wing on the right. You keep attention on the first and adjacent wing, and we'll pass the wing to the pose. Mm. Like anything, I'm gonna. No, 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 it was not no, it was not classical music or lyrical music. It was like contemporary shitty music. And it's pretty bad. Usually so. Uh I want this I would like this to feel a little more godlike though. Not that this one does. There. It does to a degree, maybe. Actually, you know what? I think this works well. Let's move the peel up a little bit. And then add the spikes. Does it need to be here? Oh, it does work. I think it seems a bit too big and distracting, maybe throwing off the pose. Mm. I know, I think like this it might work. It's not even an actual wing, it's the, the cover. It's like opening, I feel like it's like opening the chest more than anything. It's like being opened here. I could even show it like this. Because if you see the 3D model, you probably didn't see it. 3D model is like this. But I think it's just closed, and then it opens, so all those things pop out. So. I think it works like this. Might be even a little bit better if I move. This one closer so that you go back here. And this one turn. Or so slightly. I think this one works pretty well. Or about this and this, but then, yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad. This is not the eye, by the way. This is the nose. And it's looking up. Okay. All right. Let's clean this up. And uh, what did I get in Discord? Oh, you posted it? No, you didn't. Oh, you replied to you, you're dead? Yeah, well, clearly you're not dead because you're here. Mr. Cheese. Uh, I'm going to do the colors first. Uh, yeah, I'm happy though uh, how it turned out. Actually, I was, I was uh, unsure about this, but it's it's not too bad. It's not too bad. Let's say this. It's not too bad. Uh, I'm still undecided about the whatever is going on here. I might, um, yeah, I might change it like that. Actually, actually I do want to change it like that. And not nah. Oops. I have to figure out where this goes, but uh, after the color, I guess. We just uh, do a little sketch today. We have, yeah, about half an hour. Maybe a little less. Let's see where this goes. I'm going to try to reuse the original colors because colors, they're not too bad. So this might be an easy one. Let's see. First, I'm gonna get the aqua color. 
Oh yeah, you can see the texture at last. See the texture of this brush. Texture. Probably want to do something that's circular in terms of pattern. Circular works, like smoke trails or the circular or something. Then, then, uh, yes, this, yeah, I might, I might just change that head thing, turban. to be outside the wing would be so uh, go up and out like that This time, um, like for this one, I, I think it's a pretty cool monster, so I'm probably going to do a clean line art of the, a cleaner than this, anyway. This is just, a, this is a comp. This is this size. Like, this is the real size, so. <laughs> Obviously, you can't fly this way. No keys. Um, I think, oops, <laughs> okay, this was an accident, but I kind of like the fact that the fact that it's got a, a triangle there, I don't know why, it's kind of weird, I might add a triangle symbol in there, because it's cool, like what if I add a triangle there? Like a pyramid symbol, or or the eye, you know the eye of Yu-Gi-Oh. It's basically it's the opposite though, right? The Millennium Puzzle. I don't know, just an idea. Complete coincidence. No, it's not to try force. <laughs> this looks good though in terms of composition. I like it. So let's go in with some blade. Uh. Sort of blue. Let, let's move this. Um, yeah, the Illuminati symbol, basically. <laughs> Pretty much. To sum it up. Sum it up. I think it is smoke, though. Now, the more I look at it, the more it seems like smoke to me. I can do me not that much. Why is it so bad? Why does it not have a no, I don't like it. A glow. Jesus. Yeah, the Lord of Zemia or Zemia should totally have an Illuminati triangle on the hand. Makes sense. It kind of makes sense. I don't want to want to do with these areas. Clearly, some of these. Ah, uh -huh. lighting-wise, I'm not sure what I want to do, but I'm gonna have to figure it out. The wings are red. Roses are blue. No, wait a second. That's not how it is, is it? Roses are red. Wings are also red.
Yeah, the color is the color scheme of this one is not bad. It's not the least bad. So at least something is good of this uh, ridiculous <laughs> monster. Um. Oh, membranes. Uh, I don't know if you're with me on this, but I think the inside of these wings should be kind of pinkish. Because it's or or bleed over this color because it's like fleshy, right? This is the inside. This is the inside of the creature, so why not? It should be like that. It closes, right? It closes in, so why not? Why not? Roses are red, violets are blue. Are they? Well, I like Pikachu. And I choose you. Yes. I'm pretty sure that's how it was. Um, I can make the eye... Uh, no, I cannot make it red if that's red. I'm starving. Oop. I think this looks really cool. <laughs> I'm surprised. Yeah, this is much better than the original. At least for me. Sorry if you don't agree. You're wrong. No. It's legitimate. <laughs> Roses are red. Violets are blue. <laughs> that is great. Uh, if you see it as flesh, then it should be red. But if you see it as a portal to the shadow realm, then it should be purple. How about purple red? <laughs> I don't want this eye to catch too much attention, though. Shadow Eye Should be darker Dark purple And grey No, oh, something like this It's dark inside But it's, there's some light that's coming maybe from this side here Probably. Uh, so this is part of the same thing. Uh, although these supposed to be scales. How? How are they scales? Oh hey, Junkyard Wolf. How is it going? How was your last match? Or are you still playing? So we are trying to redesign Lord of Zemia here, or Zemia, or God of Zemia. This is the original on the far left, and uh, this is my redesign. I'm pretty happy with it so far. Unfortunately, I will not be able to finish it before I leave because tomorrow I really have to finish preparing baggages and my Among Us 20 kilogram suitcase. I should stop traveling with all this stuff. I'm gonna have to buy another tablet so that I can leave this here. Um, and then I have to set up my laptop just in case. And I'm probably going to have trouble uh, with trains because there are some of the services due to some work start doing. 
They surrendered after I summoned my dragon. Banished to the shadow realm. <laughs> This is looking pretty decent. That's how the card would look, basically. If I zoom out, really out. Zoom out and really out. Maybe. Go in a little more. Oh, good. I, I really color picked for this because the colors are good in the original, so. Nothing bad. Nothing too bad. Um, yes. Now, I am now a fan of Lord of Zimia. After saying, it's actually a pretty decent card. It's, it's, a, it's a good design. It's just very poorly executed. <laughs> And like Chase, I'm all for, you know, Japanese wacky designs. What the hell is that? Oh. This is supposed to be part of it. Okies. Um. Yes. Yeah, it looks good on this on this side too. It's good enough, but I prefer this. I think I'm gonna keep it. No, okay. Probably the best angle. No, I have to take the train to go to the airport. Here. And it's it's gonna be a very long flight, a very long trip, because it takes. Just the, the flights, the cumul cumulative amount of traveling on the flights is 23 hours. Plus, about four or five hours to go from here to the train, uh, to the airport. Plus, an hour and a half to go back home there if I don't have to wait my luggage for too long so you see it is a pretty consistent considerable trip nonetheless I have to do it twice a year at least how happy I am of doing this you can feel the happiness right it's contagious it's contagion contagiousing Mom laughs at me. <laughs> Where are you right now, Nim? I am in the north of Italy, and uh, I'm going back to Japan next week. So. All right, I like this. No, man, I cannot sleep on the plane. I'm not able to sleep on planes. <laughs> I wish I could. Really wish I could. I'm not a good sleeper. Any to any stretch of the imagination. So um I won't sleep. <laughs> I will have to do something else. Usually I watch movies. I try to sleep, I lie down for sure. Lie down or back. I hope it's empty, but it's not you know it was so nice. It was so nice to travel with COVID. Because uh, planes were completely empty. So you could have... Uh, basically, I had at some point I had almost the entire plane. We were three people. Three people in economy class. I don't know about first class. But three people is nice because you got a whole plane for yourself. So <laughs> I don't know if it's an A380. Cheese. Uh, probably Airbus 380. A380 probably, yeah. It is, it was really nice. It was nice, it was really, really comfortable. You could lie down and do whatever you wanted. Uh, the bathroom was always empty. <laughs> so, 
It's a treat. One day when I will be rich, <laughs> I will travel travel in first class. But until then, I'm afraid it's not an option. Not an option. If they bumped you up to first class or business, oh yeah, imagine that. Like, oh, sir, we're sorry, sir, we uh, ran out of of seats in economy class, but we do have one in first class. We will just give it. It, it happened to a person I know, actually. It happened to a person I know who is traveling, doing the same same uh, uh, trip uh, from Japan. Uh, it was to Frankfurt. Is one of the legs I have to do. Oops, I missed. Anyway, this is detailed enough now, I guess. I'll we'll probably leave it here. Close the stream because I can't finish it anyway. It's going to be finished in Japan if I survive. So if I die and, don't sur and not survive, uh, please remember me. Draw monsters in my place. <laughs> Yeah, sometimes you get bumped up. It's just the idea of sitting wedged between two people sinks. Oh, I don't. I cannot do that. So I always choose AO seats. Because I, I don't want to be... Like, if I want to go to the bathroom, I want to be able to go... Or stretch. Just... It's a... Look, 14 hours flight. Straight. I want to be able to... Uh, you know, get up if I want. Without asking... So or if someone's sleeping, I... It's very hard to feel like you, you can wake someone up, right? And since I can't sleep, I am likely to have to go to the bathroom or just wake up, just get up, to go around more often than anyone else. So, when you will be in Japan, try to buy this card. Oh, I don't know if you can send links. Tell me the name. I think only moderators can send links. Never figure it out why I can't really change it. Tell me the name. Or, or, or if you mean by this card, the Zemia. Zemia no Kami. Imagine someone having to take on Nemo's legacy because he died from going to Japan. Sometimes I think it might happen to me. <laughs> when I'm very sick, I think it might happen to me yeah I like the idea like the idea of having the window I don't I don't look down anyway just the idea of looking down makes me feel like bad <laughs> AO, AO seats are the best like it feels very spacious and it's it's kind of cool also nowadays airplanes have um uh like you can pay for Wi-Fi I don't but uh, I think I had at least one plane that had free Wi-Fi. I don't remember which company it was. It will have to... <laughs> Let's see, yeah. Oh, Lord of Zemia, okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, there is a place named Manga Soko, uh, which means Manga Warehouse near where I live, like 15, 20 minutes drive. It's not very good looking though. Uh, there's another one that's called Hard Off. That's way better. And uh, they have a lot of cards there. So I might go there with my son. But my goal right now is to uh, make cards out of the monsters I make and distribute them at my son's uh, daycare. Well, kindergarten, not daycare. Uh, so we'll see how that goes. That'll be the next Yu Gi Oh! <laughs> nah, probably not, but. That's the current plan. Anyway, all right, everybody. I know it's a little earlier, but I cannot, like, it's useless for me to start rendering this when I know that I will not be able to finish it tomorrow or or Sunday, obviously. So I'm going to close it here. And uh, I'm going to have to, well, I'll see you tomorrow, but with drawing, we're going to be back maybe next week, probably on Friday or Saturday? I don't know yet. But tomorrow we're gonna stream um we're gonna stream Final Fantasy VII in any case. So um yes. Thank you very much for being here. Thank you, a guy, for joining our stream. And uh everyone else who, who joined before, let me go back and refine 
the names of, of, of uh, the guests that came here at the very beginning. Very, very beginning. Oh, Samus, yes. Saverio, hello. Uh, if you're still there, thank you for being here. Uh, my compatriot, Italian fellow. Um, yes, so I'm going to see you guys tomorrow with FF7. And until then, you have a good day, morning, or afternoon, whatever time it is in your place. Oh, do I have Instagram? Oh, yes. Uh, absolutely, you can... Can't you see them in my about section? Anyway, it's at the art of Nemo everywhere. I don't use Twitter X that much. Uh, probably gonna leave Instagram at some point because I get no reach, but you can find them there. You can find the some more at theartofnemo.com uh, Art Station, same thing. So I'm posting some cards that I'm making uh, or monsters in, a, in the geese of cards. Um, I might re-evaluate the, the layout though before actually printing them, we'll see. Because I need to add the background anyway, so... Um, yeah, uh, I hope to see you again tomorrow, eventually, uh, a guy, or next time, whenever possible. And uh, until then, have a good one, and uh, take care. See ya.